Is differentiation even useful? Well, me and JJ even used it when we was playing Minecraft last night. We only had 20 fences left to build an enclosure, but it was annoying because however we built it, the area was always different. So how do you think we made the biggest area we could? First, I bet you said that two of these lengths plus this width would need to equal your 20 fences. But would we care more about the area of that rectangle? Yeah, the area of the rectangle is what we want to maximize. And obviously that's length times width. LW. So at this point, me and JJ rearranged this top equation to get W, and then subbed it into the area equation to get rid of it. So why'd you get rid of W? Because now we have A as a function of just L. And this is way more useful now, because area versus length has this lovely little graph. So to maximize the area, we want to find this point up here where area is as big as can be. Haley, we both know that's called a maximum, and it's basically where the derivative of our area function is equal to zero. Oh, so we need the derivative. Yeah, so you know what to do. Say it. Get out the power rule and differentiate that thing. Somebody turn that off. No, I enjoy the song. Thank you. Okay, now to find the value of L at this highest point, where the derivative is zero, we can set the derivative to zero and solve for L. Zero equals 20 minus four L, so four L equals 20 L equals five. So you get the biggest area when L is five. Five fences. And remember, we had exactly 20 fences. So this width is gonna be 10 of them. Okay, so the biggest space we can build is five fences by 10 and is 50 fences squared in area. Area, area maxing, maxing complete. complete.